So we're here at Brick Lane and we've just come from the toilet. Uh, the toilet. We've had cocktails oh, yeah. in the toilet. We've had cocktails in the toilet. And if you want to see more about that, you'll see that on Lee's channel, the Mac Master. And I'll put that on the end of this video. Uh, just click on the video and you'll see that we literally had cocktails in a toilet. Unbelievable. Public but, toilet. Public toilet. Yeah. And we had five. And I've got a new favourite cocktail, espresso martini. Absolutely mental. Um, so yeah, we're in Brick Lane in Shoreditch and we're going to get an Indian. We're going to get some Indian food and I can't wait. Ain't Marvin. And after you've eaten it, you might need a to toilet, a public toilet. Might need a public toilet. Yeah. Have another cocktail. <laughs> See you in a bit. Right, so we've got the pickle tray here. All right, we've got the, got the mango chutney. I don't know what that looks like, but it looks like a bit like a Milanese sauce. Not sure. Uh, then we've got the onions, the chopped onions. Then this apparently separates the, ma the men from the boys. Look at that, all right? So I'm gonna tell you what this is like. Here we go. Have it. Here we go. Thank you. Here we go. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. Get your drink down, yeah. Come oh, on, man. You have another. What is it? What is that? Ginger. <sighs> yes. Oh, my mouth's on fire. It's a hot one. <sighs> As I said to him, this sorts the men from the boys, so Lee, being the mech master, thought I'll have a go. But yeah, it's hot. It's coming through my nose, it's coming through my nose. <laughs> I'm laughing, you probably had it a smell. <laughs> I'm not telling you why I've had it. He thinks I'm going to say something untoward, because we've had a few uh, sherbets in the toilet and a few drinks in the toilet. We've ordered anyway. I've ordered butter chicken, uh, I've ordered a um, mushroom rice, I've ordered a peshwari naan, and uh, over to you to see what you've ordered. So I've gone for the chicken du piazza, mushroom rice as well, um, a garlic naan, and we've had a side order of okra, and that is on the back of when me and my son Luke went to the Lazatan uh, a monument near Town Bridge and we got recommended to have the opera and it was just delightful so they do it here so I've ordered it and I can't wait to try that and Lee wants to say something else so let's just change the camera around it will be interesting because you have the opera not opera don't mix it up with opera nobody's singing it uh, did you mock the opera out of 10? If you did, no, did you mock the opera out of 10? Well, it doesn't matter where you marked it, you can see whether it's as good as the opera you had to be some link.
so we've got the butter chicken here, we've got the uh, mushroom, uh, we've got the mushroom rice, we've got the uh, okra, you've got yours, we've got the peshawar in which is nice. Um, got a nice buttery chicken here. I'm going to cut into the chicken to start with and uh, see what it's like, see how uh, succulent it is. Here we go, let's have a look at this. Yeah, pretty nice, so look at that, nice uh, close up of the chicken there, look, there we go. Ah. That is nice. Mind if I have some of this. Uh, over to wash it down. Very nice. What's yours like? Right, I've got the chicken di piazza, the mushroom rice. It looks a bit hot, so I'll probably burn my tongue off. Yeah, it's not bad. It's not bad. I'm gonna tuck into this aqua and see what it's like. Good. After some cocktails in the toilet. Um, it's always good to have an Indian, isn't it? <laughs> Very quick one because it's just it's the most basic um, Indian I've had actually, to honestly say. We've had a good day today, haven't we, with food wise? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we've had a uh, fish, fish and chips. Yeah, Lee. We reviewed fish and chips, we had Wok and Soul Place, and uh, worst fish and chips in the world <laughs> that he's ever had. And uh, he marks it very poorly, but you'll see that in, in Lee's video about that, which I said before, I'll put in the description below, and also um, I'll put it on the tag on the end of the video. Um, we're going to end it outside because, I don't know, I just want to get out of here really. Um, I'm going to put the bill on there. Here's the bill. What do you think of that? For what we had, just... We didn't even eat it all, but... Anyway, I'm not going to get upset about it. Because it's Friday, so happy Friday everyone. I'll mark it outside. Yeah, we'll mark it outside. Right, okay, so we've eaten at Cream Curry House, uh, and I have to say, I'm going to say now, and I'm not just saying this for the camera, that's quite possible. You alright? How's it going? Is this your place? It is, good. It's got to be better than Cream. Cream yeah. was terrible, bad, <laughs> awful. There we go. Cream was possibly, in fact, I'd say definitely the worst Indian restaurant that I've ever been to. The curry, the butter chicken was mediocre at most. It was, it had, in fact, I've had, there's more flavour and better flavour from the inside of my boxer shorts. Yes, my friends, Cream <laughs> Curry House was the worst curry that I've ever had in, in the world. <laughs> my friends, I'm gonna give that, I mean, the Peshwari naan had literally zero taste to it. There was nothing, uh, no taste at all. Normally, a Peshwari naan should be sweet, should have a little bit of taste to it, a little bit of bite, nothing. I asked for the curry to be medium. Mm, there was more spice in the inside of Glory Restafan's bra. I don't know where that came from. Uh, it was literally Neither do I. terrible, <laughs> absolutely terrible. You've got a choice of Indian restaurants on Brick Lane where we made the huge mistake was that we were hungry, we came back from cocktails in the toilet and it was really good uh, and uh, we went in the first one and you can say as well there's also, I'll tell you what made a difference, we were called in there because there was a guy outside, a PR guy, 
you look along the street here, there are no other PR guys on the restaurants. Yeah. That guy had a PR guy pulling you in. And there's a reason why. And we were trying to review, do the review out there, and he's looking and trying to listen in. Little massive ear. Uh, I'm surprised he didn't want them little, little horns there trying to listen in. Terrible. Cream curry house, quite possibly, no, definitely the worst Indian restaurant in the world. I'm going to give it a. They don't even do a minus. I'm going to give it a 0.1. Absolutely garbage, my friends. <laughs> you live and learn. So avoid cream curry house when you come to Great Lane. Over to you. Tell me your score. So. I'm not going to give it as much detail as Lee, but all I'm going to say is that was so average, it was ridiculous. It, it was tasteless. Um, and like Lee said, I'll, I'll, I'll confirm that if you've got a PR outside a bar, I mean, blimey, I used to live in Tenerife, so I know about PRs. I'm going to go and get the cab, you, you can. Uh, they draw you in because they can't get people in without PRs. So that kind of tells you something. So it was a lesson learned today that, because we was hungry, we just uh, went to the first Indian restaurant we saw. So yeah, not great. But I'm just gonna get in the cab now. Gonna have a couple of nightcaps. Um, so this is us from Shoreditch. We're gonna say goodbye guys. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Click the like button if you liked the content but then what's there to like about the, the the meal we just had but guys see you on the next one <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> so, <laughs> so, <laughs> so <laughs> i can't tell you what uh, uh, <laughs> serious face you ready <laughs> are you tipsy <laughs> No, not at all, no. Um, I said, you need to be tipsy for that Indian. We've already done the outro, mm. but we don't want to waffle on. It was microwaved. Yeah. And we, and we even spoke to the Uber driver, lovely guy, Indian guy, who, who said, yeah, it would have been microwaved and pre made because the dish was nuclear hot. <laughs> yeah, the dish came out red hot. The waiter yeah. couldn't even touch it himself. And but, then... but the food was pretty cold in places. Yeah. So it was absolutely microwaved and yeah, I mean, we're not going to knock on about it because we, we all have bad meals, but you expect more from Brick Lane. Yeah. Um, just won't go there again, which is a shame, but there you go. Um, he didn't give us a recommendation then, if you want to tell him. He them. did, yeah. yeah. yeah City Spice in Brick Lane, he said he's one of the best. Yeah. And there's one in Bethnal Green, just around the corner. Um, I can't even pronounce it, but I'll tell you what, I'll put it in the description below. Yeah. Um, he said you have to book there, so that just means it's a good place if you've got a book. Yeah, and it was, but the one we had, terrible, expensive, not great service, not many people in it, and the rest of Brick Lane was packed. So, you live and learn, and uh, we've had, so we've had microwaved Indian food today, we've had microwaved fish and chips. <laughs> all in all, a great day. Although we did find the, uh, we have had a bonus today, didn't we? The, uh, the, the, uh, the, the you know, drinks in the public toilet. Yeah, that's always, um, <sighs> well, I don't know what to say about that, but <laughs> just, to, I'll tell you what, it's an amazing place. And I've said earlier, and I'll say it again, I'm going to put it, put it in the, on a banner at the end of the video and in the description, the Mac Master channel. What a great place to have a cocktail in a public toilet, if you please. <laughs> and no toilet well was involved. No. But, <laughs> well, we're going to end it here, I think. Yeah, We've definitely. had a, a funny old day in funny London. Old, funny old day. It's a funny old day. But, um, guys, thanks for watching. Keep it safe, and we'll see you in the next one. Definitely. In fact, how do I end it here with a bit of a London thing? It's, uh, you know, with them down at, down in uh, Brick Lane, that Indian restaurant? Yeah. Yeah. Have a word. Have a word. I'll say let's have it, but you don't really want to have that. No. So, uh, we'll see you in the next one.